The Precision Bass is a bass guitar manufactured by Fender Musical Instruments Corporation. In its stock configuration the Precision Bass is a solid body instrument equipped with a single split coil humbucking pickup and a one-piece, 20-fret maple neck with rosewood or maple fingerboard. Its prototype, designed by Leo Fender in 1950, was brought to market in 1951, the first electric bass to earn widespread attention and use, remaining among the best-selling and most imitated electric basses with considerable effect on the sound of popular music ever since. The standard P-Bass is sanded, painted and assembled in Ensenada, Baja California, Mexico along with the other standard series guitars. Fender also produces precision and precision jazz basses in its squeal line of products. Background The double bass is physically cumbersome and difficult to transport. It was also becoming hard to hear in large brands or those that used amplified instruments and it requires skill to play such that it cannot be readily picked up by any guitarist. The precision bass overcame these problems. The name precision came from the use of frets to play in tune more easily than upon the fretless fingerboard of the double bass. The electric bass lacks the distinctive acoustic qualities of the double bass, offering a more solid, harder-edged sound with more sustain. The bass became more dominant and transformed the beat and rhythm of pop music from jump blues and swing to rhythm and blues and rock music, soul music and funk. Acceptance of the electric bass was helped by the endorsement of Elvis Presley's bass player Bill Black. Black was beginning to use a precision bass during the filming of Jailhouse Rock. Fender also delivered an early precision to LA session bassist and arranger Shifty Henry. Design alterations and variants the original precision bass of 1951 shared several of its design features with the six-string Telecaster guitar, the main difference being its double cutaway body. In 1953 the precision bass received contoured edges for comfort while otherwise retaining the existing Telecaster-like styling. In 1957 the headstock and pickguard were redesigned to resemble Fender's recently introduced Stratocaster guitar, a rounder neck heel replacing the original square shape. A redesigned pickguard was made of a single layer of gold anodized aluminum with ten screw holes. At the same time the original single coil pickup was replaced by a split coil design with staggered pole pieces, connected in a humbucking mode. However, Fender never emphasized this, as the Seth Lover patent on the humbucking pickup had not yet expired. In 1959 a glued-on rosewood fingerboard featuring clay-style dot position markers replaced the one-piece maple neck and remained standard until 1966-67, when the CBS-owned Fender companies began to offer a separate, laminated maple fingerboard capped on a maple neck. Rosewood fingerboards were then made of a veneered, round laminated piece of wood and perloid dot markers replaced the clay-style inlays introduced in 1959. In 1960 the aluminum pick guard was replaced with a 13-screw celluloid design having three or four layers of black, white, mint green, aged white perloid or brown tortoise shell. The original Telecaster-derived design, with a few updates, was reintroduced in 1968 as the Telecaster bus. Within a few years, however, it had evolved into a model distinctly different from the contemporary precision bus, alongside which it was marketed until the early 80s. Two artist-designed models used a Telecaster bass body style. The Mike Deer and Precision Bass, using today's standard single-split coil pickup, and the Sting Precision Bass, using a single coil pickup as did the earliest design. Since 1969 the one-piece maple neck option has been fitted to many Fender basses and the rosewood fretboard offered as alternative. Some precision bases made in the 1970s were also available with an unlined fretless rosewood, ebony or maple fingerboard, popularized by N. Dorsey Sting and Tony Franklin. Fender briefly offered a fretless P-Bass in the mid-1990s as a part of the first-generation American standard line but dropped this variant at the end of the 20th century. From 1980 to 1984 the precision bass was given new active pickups and a high-mass brass bridge. The special featured a split coil pickup with white covers, gold hardware, a two band EQ, and an active passive toggle switch. The Elite had one or two split coil humbucking pickups, TBX tone circuit, and a shawl of fine tune bridge later used on the Pla series models of the early 1990s. 
Some models were available with solid walnut body and stained ebony fretboard. Japanese models appeared in late 1984, with a smaller body shape and a modern C-shaped maple neck with 22 medium jumbo frets. The 1990s saw the introduction of the Precision Plus and Deluxe Plus bases in 1989 and 1991, featuring lace sensor pickups, fine tuner bridges, 22 fret necks and passive or active electronics on certain models. The Custom Shop 40th Anniversary model of 1991 was a luxurious version of the Precision Plus Deluxe base with gold hardware, a quilted maple top and an ebony fretboard with side dot position markers. The American series Precision Bass was introduced in 2000 and discontinued in 2008. From 2003 the S1 switching system allowed the pickup coils to be switched from series to parallel, offering a wide eternal range, but this was discontinued in 2008 with the second generation of American Standard series instruments. The American Standard, American Deluxe, Highway 1 and American Vintage series models are manufactured in Corona, California. As of December 5, 2008 the standard P-Bass has been updated with CBS era style decals, a three-ply parchment pickguard and a tinted maple neck with rosewood or maple fingerboard. Other features include a split coil hum cancelling pickup and a return to the knurled chrome flat top control knobs. Models produced before 2003 came for a period with aged white Stratocaster control knobs. As of March 23, 2010 all American Deluxe Precision Bases came with a N3 stacked coil jazz bass pickup and the bridge position, a 21 fret tinted maple neck with compound rosewood or maple fingerboard with white or black perloid dot markers, an active passive toggle switch, a high mass vintage bridge, hipshot lightweight vintage tuners, a stealth retainer bar for the A string and a bold CBS era headstock decal. As of March 23, 2012 the American Standard Precision Bass comes with a custom shop 60s P Bass split coil humbucking pickup. The 2012 color chart listed three color sunburst, Olympic white, black, candy cola, jade pearl metallic, charcoal frost metallic as available finishes during that period. As of April 19, 2012 the American Standard Precision Bases are loaded with the Custom Shop 60s Precision Bass Split Single Coil Pickups, a 20 fret graphite reinforced maple neck with compound rosewood or maple fingerboard with white or black perloid dot markers and a high mass vintage bridge. It be bought as a 4 or 5 string base. American Deluxe Ash Body Precisions were offered from 1995 to 2006 and are currently available as of 2011. The 2004 color chart listed aged cherry sunburst, butterscotch blonde and tobacco sunburst as available finishes during that period. The Road Worn Series 50s P Bass features a distressed older body with nitrocellulose lacquer finish, a one-ply gold anodized pickguard, a synthetic bow nut, American vintage hardware a split coil humbucking pickup and a one-piece maple neck fingerboard with 20 vintage frets. Fender has also produced several deluxe or special models that feature active electronics and or a jazz bass pickup or humbucking soap bar type pickup at the bridge position as well as the normal split coil pickup to increase the tonal options available. Some P basses with J-style bridge pickups use the jazz bass control layout, two volumes and tone, and a side mount jack socket. Others had the front pickup volume control moved forward to leave room for a top-mounted jack socket. Other variants include dual-stacked control knobs similar to that of an early 1960s jazz bass or a three-way pickup selector switch. Other variants and special edition precision bass guitars have been offered in recent years. Fender made an American Deluxe five-string model with a split-coil neck pickup a humbucking J-style bridge pickup and a three-band active EQ between 2001 and 2007 and currently produces a passive American standard with a high-mass vintage bridge and a gloss-coated maple neck with satin back and vintage tinders of 2008, tuned BEADG, along with a square standard version sporting two J-bass pickups with Alnico magnets. The company has also built a Korean-made Square Pro Tone 5 string precision with dual humbuckers and gold hardware in the mid-1990s and a short-scale passive 5 string tuned DADGC called the Bass V during the CBS period in the mid-1960s. The Bass V did not sell well, 
and after it was discontinued, Fender did not offer another five-string bass guitar until the 1980s. Artists who are well enough known for using the instrument to have a signature Fender Precision bass model named for them include James Jameson, Donald Duck Dunn, Pino Palladino, Steve Harris, Mike Durant, Tony Franklin, Duff McHagan, Matt Freeman, Nate Mendel, Mark Hoppus, Pete Wentz, Sting, John Lodge D.D. Ramon, Roger Waters and Cone McAshlin. See also, Fender Telecaster Bass, Fender Jazz Bass, Squier 51, Bass Guitar, Acoustic Bass Guitar. References Literature, Peter Butges, The Fender Reference. The Mots, Zabra 1 quarter CKN 2007, ISBN 978-3-939316-38-1, Martin Kelly, Terry Foster, Paul Kelly, Fender the Golden Age 1946-1970. London and New York, Castle 2010 ISBN 1-84403-666-9.